Guys, did you know that with just nine months of studying in the US, just nine months of a degree, you can actually go ahead and get up to three years to work in the US after the degree. Yes, that's what this video is about because most people think that studying in the US is costly and yes, it is costly. But if you go for a program that is short, a short term program, which is just up to nine months to one year long, you, my friend, are eligible to work in the US for up to three years. And I'm going to tell you exactly how, what the eligibility are and what kind of programs there are. I'm even going to give you examples of such courses so you can even go ahead and apply to such specific courses if you're interested. So stay tuned and make sure you subscribe to the channel for more such content. So guys, I'm on vacation right now, but I wanted to make this video because so many of the students that we're sending right now and we're doing 5,000 plus cases every year. What's going on essentially is that students really want cheaper degrees with a higher duration of basically job permit, right? Work permit. And here I'm going to be talking to you about STEM degrees. All right, STEM degrees are degrees which are in science, technology, engineering, math. So degrees related to these fields basically are the ones where you get a three-year work permit after education instead of a one-year work permit. This work permit is called Optional Practical Training, OPT, which allows you to work in the US, again, as long as you want based on your, of course, as long as you're basically in the same field, right? But it's one year long maximum for non-STEM degrees, basically degrees which are not in science, tech, engineering, and math, whereas it is three year long essentially with the extension if you have a degree in science, technology, engineering and math and that is just the beauty of it you can actually go for such degrees which are short term which you know again normal master's degree is two years bachelor's degree is four years but if you go for something like this as a student who has already gotten their bachelor's let's say now you're going for additional course right you can go for a one year program and you very easily secure a three year work permit let me give you a couple of examples of such programs. For instance, take a look at this program from, from one of the best universities in the US. This is the University of Texas, Austin. And the program is called MSBA, Master of Science in Business Analytics. This program is just 10 months long, as you can see on your screen, and it is STEM designated. That means that since it is STEM designated, it's 10 months long, you will basically get access to OPT after the program. That means for three years, basically, you get to work in the US. And of course, it's not just that you'll get three years, you'll start applying for the H-1B and you can basically settle down with just this one program itself. The next one, for instance, over here is from Columbia University, one of the Ivy Leagues, MS in Operations, Research and Industrial Engineering. This program is two semester long, and as you can see, two semesters is somewhere around again, you can say 10 months only, because there's summer vacations as well. And on top of that, this gives you access to the STEM OPT as you can see over here with proof I'm showing each and every one of these programs. The next one here is from Duke University, again one of the best universities out there. Again, the program length here is just one year, whereas you get access to STEM again as you can see with proof over here. I'm showing you each and every one of these programs. The next one is from Cornell. Cornell Tech, as you may know already, again another Ivy League university over here. You go for the Masters of Engineering program over here and they will give you again a STEM designation with a one year program length only. That means you just study for one year and then you can have access to this amazing New York area. You can work for three good years. And again, you can basically continue on in 20 from there. One last one for you guys. Purdue University, again, one of the best as you already know. BIM program, this is business analytics and information management program. This also, as you can see in the screenshot, is a 12 month long program and is STEM designated. That means you get access to one year of education and then three years to basically work in the US. Now remember, these are just some of the programs. There's hundreds of them out there. It's all about finding the right program for you. So if you feel that these are not the ones for you, you want them in your field, you're not getting the right ones, reach out to me and take a look at the shortlisting service we have where we basically we can shortlist such universities for you based on your exact requirements and field. In case your requirements for the exact program you're looking for are a little bit different, no problem. You can still reach out and you can let me know that, hey, Yash, this is what I'm looking for. This is the kind of universities I want. This is the program length I want. And accordingly, we can find such universities for you because we are doing it on a daily basis for hundreds of students out there. And finally, for more content like this, and if you appreciate this, share it with the people who need to know. Follow me on Instagram where we have a lot more content different than this, but similar. So you'll have much more opportunities. And apart from that, I hope that this video helped. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye and take care until next time.